opening with the queen's pawn controls the center and usually leads to a more positional development of the pieces. d5 establishes a presence in the center, controls the e4 square, and opens up the light squared bishop. The queen's gambit offers up a wing pawn to attack the center and distract black from the e4 square. e6 declines the queen's gambit by defending the central d5 pawn with the e pawn. And c3 puts more pressure on the d5 square and helps control the e4 square. b7 develops the bishop without committing the knight to f6. And f3 develops the knight toward the center, supports the d4 pawn and controls the e5 square. This develops a knight off its starting square, getting it into the action. This activates a bishop by developing it off of its starting square. The opposing bishop is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. This moves the bishop to safety. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling king side tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. b6 prepares to fianchetto the light squared bishop to b7, where it will sit on the long diagonal. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. This develops the bishop and gives it scope on the long diagonal. This is an equal trade. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. After all captures, this is an equal trade. Takes back. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent avoids some of the attacking associated with opposite side castling. It is the last book move. This develops a queen off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is good. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. The rooks can see each other now, allowing them to provide mutual defense. It is excellent. This is a fair move. It is good. One of the best moves. It is excellent. This is an equal trade. It is excellent. Recaptures. It is best. That's what I would have recommended. It is best. This ignores an opportunity to double rooks on a single file. It is a mistake. This threatens to fork pieces. It is best. This prevents the opponent from being able to fork pieces. It is best. This threatens to create a passed pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This threatens to win material. It is good. This makes a passed pawn, meaning no opposing pawn can challenge it on its way to promotion. This is the only move that works. It is best. This takes an outpost, an active square where the knight cannot be kicked out by a pawn. It is best. This protects the attacked pawn. It is excellent. This kicks an opposing queen. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This move puts the queen on a safer square. This threatens to reveal an attack on a rook. It is best. This wins a tempo by threatening a bishop and forcing it to move away. It is best. This offers an equal trade of pieces. This threatens to reveal an attack on a rook. It is best. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This prevents the opponent from being able to reveal an attack on a rook. It is best. Takes back. This threatens to reveal an attack on a rook. It is best. This stops the opponent from being able to win material. It is best. This attacks a queen, winning a tempo when it moves away. It is best. This threatens to activate a rook by getting it to the 7th rank. This permits the opponent to win a tempo by threatening a knight. It is an inaccuracy. This wins a tempo by threatening a knight and forcing it to move away. It is best. This blocks an attack on a vulnerable pawn. This threatens to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is best. This ignores an opportunity to reveal an attack on a rook. This permits the opponent to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is an inaccuracy. This leads to losing a pawn. 
there was only one good move there. This misses an opportunity to push a past pawn towards promotion. It is a blunder. This is the way to win a pawn. This is the only good move. This was a game-changing move, giving black a winning position. It is a great move. Recaptures. It is best. Capturing that pawn wins material. It is best. Takes back. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. This move puts the queen on a safer square. This threatens to win a queen. It is best. The opposing rook is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This places a rook on the seventh rank, activating the rook and restricting the opponent's king. It is good. That's not a mistake, but it's not the best move either. It is good. This blocks the check from an opposing queen. It is good. There was only one good move in that position. It is a mistake. This is the only move that works. This was a game-changing move, white is no longer in a losing position. It is a great move. This steps away from the checking rook. It is best. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This steps away from the checking rook. It is best. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This steps away from the checking rook. It is best. This is the only good move. It is a great move. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. Both players navigated the middle game well. 